but they got enough run support in the victory as they go on to shut out Kansas City four to nothing. Back to softball, the postseason will continue for the Villa Maria softball team after claiming its third and final District 10 championship in team history on Monday while wearing the victors' blue and white uniforms. This season has been a gritty one for Villa Maria with its roster consisting of underclassmen. While they are constantly growing and maturing on the field, they are also aware that they are the final Villa Maria athletic team left and they want to end this on a high note. I'm just, I'm still in shock, especially because this is our last year as the Villa Victors. Next year we're going to be the Prep Ramblers, and it's just going to be completely different, even if it is the, mostly the same girls. So I am so happy for every single girl on this team that we won the D10 Championship as the Villa Victors. It's just amazing that we could come out and be the last team, the last team to be remembered with our swimming team doing great, our volleyball team doing great, and then for our softball team to just pull through and get this D10, it feels great, and I feel like we're going to make make some great memories next year as Cathedral Prep, but these ones, these are great. You can't leave out the Villamaria basketball team also doing well, making it to the state final four. The softball team, meanwhile, will face Burl on Monday.